God is Not Great by Christopher Hitchens, page 71. Credibel est quia ineptum est, as the church father Tertullian put it, either disarmingly or annoyingly according to your taste. Its very improbability makes it believable. It is impossible to quarrel seriously with such a view. If one must have faith in order to believe something or believe in something, then the likelihood of that something having any truth or value is considerably diminished. The harder work of inquiry, proof and demonstration is infinitely more rewarding and has confronted us with findings far more miraculous and transcendent than any theology. Actually, the leap of faith to give it the memorable name that St. Kierkegaard bestowed upon it, is an imposter. As he himself pointed out, it's not a leap that can be made once and for all. It is a leap that has to go on and on, being performed in spite of mounting evidence to the contrary. This effort is actually too much for the human mind and leads to delusions and manias. Religion understands perfectly well that the leap is subject to sharply diminishing returns, which is why it often doesn't rely on faith at all, but instead corrupts faith and insults reason by offering evidence and pointing to confected proofs. This evidence and these proofs include arguments from design, revelation, punishments and miracle. Now that religion's monopoly has been broken, it is within the compass of any human being to see these evidences and proofs as the feeble-minded inventions that they are. Christopher Hitchens